So today we're talking about Denison, Texas, and you guys may not know where that is, but I'm here to show you because it is a super up and coming town. It's very, very small. It's actually in Grayson County. And if you've ever heard of the Red River, it is actually what separates part of Oklahoma from Texas. And that's what borders up here is the Red River. Denison actually is super close to Lake Texoma. I don't know if you've heard of that, but it is the largest water reservoir in the United States. Man, my hair is growing crazy today. And so if you like lake living, then you're gonna love Lake Texoma. You can hike, you can camp, you can get on all the water sports. It's a stunning lake and Denison is super close to that. Plus the casinos are right over the border in Oklahoma if casino is your thing to do. Denison has a population of 24,000, so it's not the biggest city, but again, it's growing. You are about an hour from the Dallas-Fort Worth Airport and you are also about an hour from Dallas. So it'd be quite the drive if you worked in Dallas. So bestplaces.net recently did a survey that sh actually showed that they expected Denison to have a job growth of over 39% in the next 10 years. So it's gonna be crazy. Neighborhoods.com ranked Denison actually the number one hottest housing market in the country. And a big reason for that is you can still get really great deals out here. There are a lot of master plan communities coming in as well as new construction and shopping for a small town. Denison actually has some pretty great spots to eat. The first one I wanna share with you guys is the rail yard food hall. It's kind of like a big open food court. They have everything from sliders, poke bowls, pizza, hot wings, and sushi. There's also 34 chop house and docks lounge. This spot has amazing reviews. It has a beautiful bar and their menu's amazing. Everything from ahi tuna, grilled lamb, calamari, shrimp and grits, ribeye, everything under the sun. Shopping in Denison is not the best. There's lots of little cute shops downtown and I believe we're gonna see a ton more come into the area in the next five to 10 years. And it will be totally renovated and super cute. Blue Ryan Boutique is a woman's store. They actually have everything from jewelry, women's clothing. Another cute women's boutique is Salty Lime. If you're into antiquing, there are so many great spots in this, and one spot is called Main Street Mall, and you guys need to check it out. So you're gonna be a part of Denison ISD, and overall it's got a B rating, but a lot of times you see in the smaller towns that as they grow, the school rating goes up because they have more taxes that are being able to pump into the schools and bring in a lot more families. So in a few years, as the city grows, that rating is more than likely gonna jump up to A. That's what we see in a lot of the small towns around here. There are about four elementaries, a couple of junior highs and a high school. And some of those do rank exemplary status, so you'll just need to find out which ones. You can go to niche.com to see that. One more side note is that Denison actually has a junior college called Grayson College. So you could get all of your original, you know, starting credits and then go to another major school if you wanted to save some money. It's super hot out here. We are uh, in June now. So we're coming up on those July, August months that are just super hot. And that's something you need to know moving to Texas is that it, it's so hot here, but it's very, it's only a couple of months and then it gets a lot more mild. Overall, Denison has a very low cost of living. The median home value is about 111,000 and if you're finding houses that are, you know, close to 100,000, they're typically gonna be older, maybe built in the 30s, 40s, maybe 50s. But today I'm gonna show you a little bit of both. And the very end of the video, I'm gonna show you the most expensive house in Denison, which I think is, you guys need to see. The average household income is about 53,000. So that kind of tells you a little bit about the city. So now that I've given you some facts, let me show you around Denison. So now we're in a master plan subdivision. It's brand new called Gateway Village. And you can see as I walk through the neighborhood that there's lots of lots that are still being built on, but it's it's the one of the first healthy lifestyle communities, which is really its name. I haven't ever heard of it before, but it's got four different sections of residential. And then it also has some commercial aspects to it where it's got dining and shopping and it's got some hospitals and just tons of amenities that are, I think, really family centric and can just help you really enjoy the area that you live in. The community has everything from walking trails to bikes to fields for kids to do soccer on. If you kind of look back here, behind me, you can see there's walking trails back there and the houses are just beautiful. So 
lots of new construction. If that's something you want, let me know. I can help you find a place, um, custom building, or just picking a home builder that's already out here. So there will also be playgrounds, splash pads, and picnic pavilions that are covered since it is so hot here. You can have a little bit of shade. As far as the retail space, there are restaurants, there are coffee shops, there's entertainment spaces. There's a place called Heyday, and it's a family entertainment space. It's got bowling, laser tag, golf, and a lot more. So we take the whole family there. And then you're just gonna have a lot of restaurants that um, are popping up all over the place. So the four subdivisions, they're not subdivisions, this is the subdivision, but the four areas in the subdivision are Saddle Creek, Greenway Parks, Fawn Meadow, and the Reserve. And I'm gonna show them all to you right now. Saddle Creek has lots for sale at the moment. Each lot is a little more than half an acre and homes in Saddle Creek are gonna be a little more on the luxury side. The square footage starts around 4,400 square feet. Home prices in Saddle Creek are gonna average about 1.5 million. And at this point, I don't see a lot of available homes, but I see a lot of lots that are for sale that you can do a custom build. Greenway Parks also has lots for building, but it's going to be a smaller semi-custom home with a smaller lot. Most will be a little less than half an acre. And actually in this neighborhood, you will have access to the THF Sports Complex, which is baseball and soccer, splash pads, trails, and lots of parks. And the homes in this section are gonna start around 550,000. Fawn Meadow will actually be a place that will offer smaller home sites, but also have a lot of neighborhood amenities. People here will get to choose from four different builders once they purchase their lot. Homes in the neighborhood is, are gonna start around 400,000. And right now there's actually one available listed at 399,000. The reserve is the last one in Gateway Village. It's actually the closest to Lake Texoma and Loy Lake for some lakeside fun. Homes in the reserve are gonna start around 330, 335,000. And homes in the reserve will go all the way up to 600,000. There are multiple homes available in the reserve right now. So if that's something that you want me to send to you, drop a comment below and I can send you what's available. Now I just wanna point out a couple of homes that are on the market at this actual time of the filming of this video. So if you drive around Denison, you're gonna see a lot of older homes built in the 20s and 30s that sit around 150,000. Most of them are gonna to need to be renovated, but they can be super cute and have tons of charm. The first one I wanted to show you has been renovated and it's 920 West Sears Street in Denison. This home was built in 1940. It has charm. You can tell it's been redone well. It's two bedroom, one bath. It is 1,065 square feet and it is currently listed at $228,900. Next, I wanna show you a home that sits on one acre just about a mile away from downtown. It is a four bedroom, two bath, 1,850 square feet and it's right now listed at 460,000. It's actually brand new construction and it's adorable and look what it backs up to. This is 1695 Devoinus Road in Denison. The last home I want to show you guys in this video is pretty freaking unbelievable. It's the most expensive home right now listed in Denison. It has seven bedrooms, 10 bathrooms. It's 11,551 square feet. It is massive. It has an unbelievable backyard oasis. It has one pool that actually flows into another pool that's at a lower level. It actually has a helicopter pad as well. It has a full game room with a second kitchen in the game room. And it sits on Lake Texoma, which is why it's so expensive. And the lake views are unbelievable. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this tour of Denison. I had to get inside because it is so friggin' hot out there. But I, I wanted you guys to know Denison is growing. If you're buying out there, then you're going to have equity because of everything that's coming in to the town of Denison. If you have questions, reach out. We'll get them all answered. You can call me, text me, email, Zoom, doesn't matter. I'll get your questions answered. And with that, thank you so much for watching this video. And until the next one, we hope you have a great rest of your day.